What's up everybody? This is Chris, your local Wheeler here at Wheeler Dealer in Boise, Idaho. Got another incredible truck to share with you guys. Um, we are very, very fortunate to be offering this truck for sale. Um, so I'm going to go ahead and jump right in. Um, as you can tell, uh, there's been quite a few modifications to the truck. Um, but what this is, this is a 1991 Toyota pickup. It's an extended cab, five-speed, four-wheel drive truck. Um, this truck, uh, obviously, like I said, has had extensive modifications done to it. Um, so I'm going to go ahead and just jump right into it. Um, as you can see, I've got the hood open here, uh, making it a little easier for myself to make this video. Um, but we're going to go ahead and just start with the good stuff here in the engine bay. Take a look at that. So this is obviously not a uh, Toyota engine. Um, this is actually a TDI turbo diesel um, that was swapped in from a 2001 Volkswagen Jetta. The motor was fully rebuilt uh, about 20,000 miles ago. Uh, when they rebuilt the motor, uh, they used some H-beam connecting rods, ASV pistons. It's got a stage 2 Franco 6 camshaft in it. Um, obviously has all new bearings, seals, all the gaskets, um, full top and bottom end rebuild. Um, taking a look down in here, got a new GT 1856V turbo. Uh, currently running 260 injectors. It's got an 11 millimeter injection pump. It's got a nice PD lift pump as well. Front mount intercooler tucked back in here, really nice. A um, couple of things, you know, when I'm looking at stuff like this, um, I like to look at small things that kind of will in indicate, um, you know, the rest of the build quality. And some of those things are things like this. If you look at all this charge piping, so um, this is all aluminum, uh, TIG welded, powder coated. Um, and look at these pie cuts, I mean, just like really, really clean install. Very, very cool looking. Um, you can just tell that a lot of thought went into it. Um, this is not something that can just easily be slapped together. Um, uh, currently running a four bar map sensor on here, which is nice. Um, definitely able to handle the added boost and fuel. Um, nice three row aluminum radiator in here. The engine bay is uh, clean as you can tell. It is um, fresh painted as well. Um, it was painted with the two stage, so base coat, clear coat. Really, really cool looking uh, engine bay. I mean, it's definitely, um, it's a little dirty. Like I said, it's it's snowing here. It's been raining out. Um, I did just wash the truck, but driving it two minutes and everything gets dirty. So, um, but yeah, I'm just gonna, before we close this, I'll go, I'll go around here and just show everything. So I'm going to attempt to shut this with one hand, bear with me guys. Okay. I'm going to take a step back here and just now that we've got that closed, take a look at the truck. Um, so the paint on this was just recently redone as well, body work looks great. I mean, the truck just, like I said, it's dirty out, and I did have to drive it here, but you can just tell it's, it's a super, super clean looking truck. All right, so sticking with uh, this stuff up underneath here, a completely rebuilt R150F. Shifts perfect. Clutch feels great. Four wheel drive was perfect. I mean, just look at the underside of this truck, guys. Really, really clean. 
<clears throat> um, so this year of uh, Tacoma came with an independent front suspension. Um, this one has been solid axle swapped. Um, this front axle is um, trussed, completely rebuilt, all new gaskets and seals, knuckles look good. Um, disc brakes up front here. Um, both front and rear uh, axles are 488 geared. High pinion third member here up front. Crossover steering. Like I said, the axle housing's been trussed. Some Bilstein shocks here as well, with some custom shock hoops. Just a really, really clean install. I mean, super, super clean. <clears throat> Take a look at this side here. Take a look at the rear axle here. Once again, completely rebuilt, 488 gears. U-bolt flip kit on this one. Uh, these rear leaf packs are from a F-150. And some nice Bilsteins back here as well. Really nice TIG welded stainless steel exhaust. Take a look at this flatbed. Look how cool this is. reverse lights and brake lights um, and then these light pods are uh, tied into a switch on the inside and just crazy cool looking <laughs> crazy cool looking really well built Super clean paint. So the front end of this um, is actually a forerunner conversion. Um, so everything uh, from the core support um, all the way out is uh, has been replaced. So full conversion um, really adds a nice look to the front end of the truck. <clears throat> a really nice plate uh, move front bumper. I've got a 24 inch. Uh, LED bar here in the front, two pods on either side, a couple D rings, just a really, really clean looking setup. Good high clearance, looks beefy, um, just a really clean look. I really, really like it. <clears throat> I know I keep saying that, I'm, and <laughs> I'm probably going to keep saying it. Um, some nice 20 by 12 inch TIS off road uh, rims on here. Manual front lock and hubs. They are wrapped in um, some Aturo uh, blade MTs or trail blade MTs. I'm sorry, they are 35 inch by 1250s. Pretty much brand new. A nice Satoshi grill up here in the front too, I didn't mention that. Um, really nice custom projector headlights here. Um, there is a halo uh, behind a turbine shroud here. So you can see that, that white ring uh, behind that turbine. Super cool looking.
take a look at the inside here. Some nice bucket seats. Headliner looks great. Um, got an exhaust gas temp gauge here, boost gauge here. Nice cluster here. Truck is showing 251,807 miles. Um, all of the gauges work. Uh, tack works, speedo works, um, temperature, oil pressure, bolt, everything works. Um, so we've got uh, switches for uh, some of the lights, um, the spotlights and then the rear lights. So this is the uh, large LED pod in the front, the smaller pods up in the front and then the rear lights. said it is a uh, five-speed manual four-wheel drive and a nice double din uh, head unit in here touch screen the truck does not have AC but the heater does work as it as it was intended really really clean install here um, also have some six and a half inch um, speakers in the doors I'm not sure what brand those are <clears throat> back here yeah, the trucks in just crazy good shape um, carpet looks good no smells no tears a couple small stains on the front seats but nothing abnormal um, jump seats back here So I say this in every one of my videos, guys. <laughs> I get a lot of people that uh, message me on YouTube or message me on Facebook um, or call us at the shop. And they say they seen, uh, saw one of our YouTube videos and asking about trucks. Uh, I don't run a storage lot. <laughs> all, all of this stuff sells and it sells quick. So if this is something that you're interested in, if you want some more information about it, uh, want a better look at some stuff, let me know. Um, I'm more than happy to do live video calls, um, take it to a uh, different place if you want to have it inspected by a third party. Um, we can arrange shipping. I'll also pick you up from the airport if you want to fly here. We do work with any lender, um, so if you need help getting financing, uh, let me know. We can also help with that. Yeah, this is definitely not going to last very long. <clears throat> definitely not. If some you're interested in, let me know. Um, I'm going to uh, go ahead now and try to hop in. I may have to take another video here, um, but I'll get in and go drive it around a little bit. Oh, got my stuff here. All right, guys, I'm gonna set my phone down for just a second so I can get in. All right, boy, that never gets any easier. <laughs> okay, we got the keys. So uh, the battery is, is a little low. Um, alternator's obviously working like you can see there. Um, but the, uh, so the battery light and the brake light will go off um, here in just a few minutes after it's, uh, the alternator has charged that battery a little bit. It's also like 20 degrees here right now. Alright, 
so battery, uh, the brake light I think was actually because I had the parking brake on, but battery lights off. Alrighty, I'm going to do my best to uh, drive this with one hand and take this video, so bear with me. We'll go ahead and shut this off so you guys can hear this. I mean, how cool is it to hear this sound coming from a Toyota pickup? <laughs> Steering's nice and tight. grabby to where it's like jerky um, but it definitely feels like it can hold the power I'm gonna actually I'm gonna go right here truck is uh, really really nice nice dash I'm gonna smell like a smoker has ever owned it I don't see any signs of having pets in here either but I'm not not hundred percent sure about you know any of that stuff but it doesn't have any smells or stains or um, nothing's chewed up or anything Let's see temp gauge works oil pressure gauge, tack, speedometer obviously I'm not moving right now but speedo works, Volt, voltmeter, fuel level,
that one. <clears throat> Anyways, guys, like I said, um, definitely not going to last long. So if this is something you're interested in, um, feel free to contact us. I'll put up all of our contact information down below. I'm more than happy to do anything. I buy um, and sell cars out of state all the time. So I understand the process. I know that it can be nerve wracking. Um, my job here is not to try to make you buy this. My job is to make sure that this goes to somebody who um, understands what it is um, and can appreciate it and uh, that I can make sure that you're set up for success. So if there's anything that I can do um, to make this transaction easier, please don't hesitate to ask. Um, we also love talking about this stuff. So if you have any questions or want to know anything else, let me know. Other than that, man, you guys have a good day, and I will be back soon. We've got another couple of trucks to show you guys, so uh, if you want to follow us, um, go ahead and follow us, and you get notified when uh, we post another truck up. I've got a couple of other, other trucks that are coming up right now um, that are really, really cool. We just got done with the uh, factory turbo 20, uh, the 22RTE 4Runner, um, so I'll be posting a video about that here pretty soon. Um, anyways, you guys have a good day. Take it easy.